This week, ISIL lost CERT, its only foothold in Libya. Apart from a few pockets, the jihadists have been completely driven out of the coastal city. For the moment, the victory of forces backed by the pro-unity government based in Tripoli ends ISIL's ambition of expanding its self-declared caliphate in the North African nation. But the group's downfall in Libya also raises the question of what next in a country which has been plagued by violence since the ousting and death of its former strongman, Colonel Gaddafi. Libya still remains deeply divided with administrations in both the east and west. A complex network of rival factions and militias also threatens a new chapter of turmoil. Meanwhile, the instability has made the country a hub for people trafficking. We're just a business, a commodity for them. They just want to use us to enrich themselves. Euronews' Valerie Goria has travelled to Libya to see firsthand the situation facing migrants. Watch her exclusive report tonight in Insiders, only on Euronews.